And he's won two Ninja Sport Network comps that we've covered in the past, but hasn't quite broken through into winning one of the Ninja Sport Championships. But here we go. He's in the finals now. Trying to get a top spot this time through. Nice transition over on the switcheroo. Nice dismount. And dropping clips coming in. For that third large drop there. And gets the dismount. Heading on through these dropping steps. Got to be quick. One, two, three, four. No issues. Collapsing down, making sure that he's got it in control. TikTok, one of his favorite obstacles here. Jumping in and twisting, no problem. No stranger to that swinging obstacle. And transition into the spider. Might be something new that we haven't seen before. But Noah not being phased whatsoever. And with those transitions midair with that ring twist. And ooh, ooh, right on the ledge of that landing, linking all those moves. Nice job, Noah. Moving very fast to this point. And on to the mega throwback. Right away catches. Okay, Noah, nice work here. And moves through mega throwback unfazed at a minute 25 to the missile silo. Incredible fast time here. Getting ready for these dynamic moves up through these silos. Great links here. Looking for the drops down now. All this is just going to continuously drain that endurance for later on. Trying to be efficient as possible is very important. Noah taking the bucket of chalk with him. <laughs> Wants to get that chalk, keeping that grip alive. Well, he's made incredible pace up to this point. Lots of time remaining. He's taking his rest here because you know if he can lock this move in, on the first try, he's going to really set himself up well. Nice continuous Lachey through. Pips back and up. Ugh. Oh, my gosh, he overshot. He got one side up and had so much power that he went beyond the bear trap on one side. Yeah, Strat, if you notice, a lot of the athletes are looking to one side to make sure they get it in there. That's usually the side that gets in the bear trap, and it's the other side they're not looking at that always seems to lag behind, or in Noah's case, in front. Oh no, overshot of the first flying bar cradle. I think he's just going for speed here. It's coming back to bite him a little bit. So now he only has one chance remaining, a full minute left. Does it take any more time to collect himself? It's gonna take a few more seconds. That's all he needs. And goes for that flying bar and again just overshoots really wanted to push the pace and that he did to get to that last obstacle quickly but unable to make it all the way through and here we go pedal to the metal Noah on the move went on out nice swing through off of the rope Ooh, skipping that last bar not opting to grab it gonna try to save some time when he can vaults one vaults two Big leap into that spider hallway, hopping his way through and dropping in. Now it's time for these Lachey's gonna grab and link if he can. Link and drop. Sprint up for that ramp. Under leaps. That seems to be the technique now. A lot of people have taken this path and getting that linked Lachey for the dismount. Good job from Noah to link those as well and sprinting and trying to get sub 40 as well. 39.5 slam into the wall. And here we go. Starting things off with the Iron Maiden sleeves. To those bars and transitioning down for those bookshelves. See that pinch power being activated as he goes through. The variety of handholds that you have to make is just going to burn out all those muscles and Lachey's from the next to last second to next to last floating cliffhanger to save some of that grip. I was going for another big move here. 
bar to swinging cliffs. Wants to try to get off of there, back onto the bars to relax. Pads up with chalk as he goes and starts the operation. Up and in, skipping a few when he can. Trying to find the end point he wants to get to. And nice work as he gets to that finish. Rest point right there. Oh, with the leg tech. Wow. Able to rest entirely only on the front three sides that is in play. Wow. That is the rules. So only thing that does is really tax the lower body. He still has to utilize those hip flexors, but gives those hands a lot of rest time, taking away the pressure from those hands. Going for that Sasuke style 180 turn. Love to see it. Noah moving quick still. Get some more fresh chalk from the bucket of chalk. And right away into it, Noah wanting to go in to this and that reverse style with the twist around. Reverse is going to tax those biceps a little bit more than the forearms on the front facing grips. But now he's in and two of the rhythm here for the thin ledges. Let's see how far he can get here. Slowing it down a bit, trying to be methodical which is with his approach here. Fighting through. So close. Here it gets thin. And oh, not quite there. Noah Munir, still a great run. Quick to that point. With that fancy leg tech to wrap around the pillar.